Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Astra, India's first beyond visual range air to missile, indigenously designed and developed by DRDO and manufactured by Bharat Dynamics Limited. It is a fifth generation missile which will replace Vampil R-77 and Matra Super 530D missiles that Indian Air Force fighters are equipped with now. The missile costs just rupees 7.5 crore apiece, a fraction of cost of Russian, French and Israeli BVR AAMs that Indian Air Force fighters are now armed with. Last year in July 2020, the Defence Ministry approved the acquisition of 33 new Russian fighter jets including 12 Su-30 MKIs and 21 MiG-29s along with 248 Astra beyond visual range air to air missile. These missiles are to be integrated with Su-30 MKIs of Air Force and MiG-29K of Navy and has been extensively tested with both of these fighters. Astra has completed its final developmental trials in September 2017 and was cleared for production at BDL's manufacturing facility in Telangana for initial order of 50 missiles. Indian Air Force has already received 50 pre-production Astra missile back in 2019 followed by an order of 200 more missiles. Once the order of 200 missiles is complete, the much bigger order of Astra more than 400 missiles can be expected for MiG-29 UPG and LCA Tejas of Air Force. The flight trials of Astra on HL Limited Sys Production Tejas will be carried out in 2022. The Astra is designed to engage and destroy high maneuvering supersonic aircraft. The missile has all weather day and night capability. It is being developed in multiple variants to meet specific requirements. Astra MK-1 weapon system integrated with Su-30 MKI aircraft is being inducted into Indian Air Force. It can be launched in autonomous and buddy mode of operations with features for lock-on before launch and lock-on after launch. Talking about the specification of Astra missile, it is 3.84 meter long with a diameter of 178 mm and weighs 154 kg. It is lighter when compared to Russian R-77 missiles, allows easier integration with better aerodynamic performance. It carries a 15 kg of high explosive pre-fragmented warhead which is activated by a proximity fuse. Astra uses a smokeless solid fuel motor that can propel the missile to a speed of Mach 4.5 and allows operation for a maximum altitude of 20 km. The maximum range of Astra is 110 km in head-on chase mode and 20 km in tail chase mode. Astra at present uses Russian active radar seeker having a homing range of 25 km. It can lock a target of 5 square meters from a distance of 15 km. The Russian radar seeker will later be replaced with indigenously developed KU band radar seeker which will have lock on range between 13 to 20 kilometers. Astra uses inertial navigation and driven by fiber optic gyroscope and terminal guidance through active radar homing. It is capable of receiving mid course correction through a secure data link. Astra is also equipped with electronic countermeasures which makes jamming of its seeker difficult. The induction of Astra will act as a force multiplier for the Indian Air Force beyond visual range fighting capabilities and at the same time reduce import burden from the foreign OEM companies such as MBDA and Rafael. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.